Hello friends, I am Rehan, software developer, Android application developer and also website developer. In this tutorial series, you will learn more about Library 6.2, both administration part and development part. And, uh, and that is the objective of this uh, tutorial series, to subscribe to my channel for more videos. So in this first video, you will just, uh, I will just tell about a little theory part about what is Library. Uh, so that um, so, so that you'll get clear concept about what is library. So based on your requirement, whether you can judge, whether you can use library for your customer requirement or not. So let's see the first slide. So what is library? Before we go into what is library, I would like to mention a difference between a portal website and a normal website. So, uh, portal website. Or actually, first we will see through a normal website. Normal website means uh, the the commercial websites like your personal website uh, and uh, these are uh, shopping websites. And these websites are normal websites. Okay. So the portal websites are nothing but a website that uh, that runs a lot of portlet segment. So what is a portlet? Well, wait. I will show you a small example. This iGoogle.com is the best uh, example for, uh, for for portal website. So if we go to iGoogle.com, it's opening. This is actually the best example for the portal website. See, if you can see, the website has many number of blogs. One is US stock market, another one is weather, another one is Wikipedia. And like this, similarly, Google links, fixture, inspiration codes, Facebook, and everything is here. So if we can see, uh, these, uh, this, this is U.S. stock market. This is weather. This is Wikipedia. If we can see, this U.S. stock market gives the information about the U.S. stock information. This weather, uh, this weather block gives the information about the weather of the current cities. And this Wikipedia, it just give a Wikipedia search. So. There are th th so these three are actually a different applications. Uh, they are the different small small applications. Okay, so these th these small small applications are called as portlets. So this po a portal is a collection of po diff uh, different portlets and different portlets are they so that is called as a portal. So this is what is a, a portal website and a normal website as I have already told you, it is actually. Uh, it's actually like a websites like uh, the commercial websites like shopping websites and these websites are normal websites so coming back to our slide so uh, first we are discussing about what is the difference between the portal website and the normal website now what is library okay library is free and java based open source software used to develop websites and enterprise level portals uh, guys, don't think that I am just reading this line. I just wrote these points uh, for you to note it down. Uh, the actually, I, I just uh, uh, brought only the main points here, and that will cover up all the concepts of library. Okay, so I'll, I'll explain each and every point, so you don't worry. Okay, so library is a free and Java-based open source software. Okay, uh, and it is used to develop websites and enterprise level portals. So yes, the library is used to develop a portal website. That's, uh, so this iGoogle.com, this is an example of portal website. So you can develop a, a website like this and also portals for corporate companies you can develop. Okay, and also normal website also you can develop through library. Okay. And the library has been uh, so uh, has been declared as the best open source portal by InfoWorld in 2007. This is a small history about library. So it's mainly used to develop portals for corporate companies and web web application. As I have already told you, library is used to develop for uh, develop portals for corporate companies and web applications. Uh, um, and uh, web applications like uh, secure web applications you can develop from library like uh, banking applications those things you can develop from library okay so the and also you don't need to have a basic programming language for the installation of library 
yes you like uh, i can the other uh, other cms uh, other cms you need to have some programming language but here you can just uh, extract and you can just start the server and you can uh, you can go on create your own portal or website so it library library is a uh, very easy to install and administrate also okay so this is uh, what is called as library hope you guys like it and see you in the next tutorial bye bye